All right, y'all, we are back with another video, and here we go again with the view. Obviously, a, a, a whole crew that cannot stop talking about Donald Trump. They hate Donald Trump so much. Listen to this. They hate Trump so much that they can't stop talking about him. They got to talk about him every day. And I feel like all of them is just really, really just disrespectful towards Donald Trump. How can y'all, They how can they sit here and talk crap about Donald Trump when look what Biden has done? He has destroyed our country. Look at the open borders. Inflation was high. Like, just look at all the crap that Biden has been doing that just does that just doesn't destroy us. But yet they sit on this show and just try to downplay Donald Trump, slander this man name, talk crap about him. Joe Behar uh, up there was hoping Donald Trump choked on a cheeseburger. I mean, this is the things that they say on this show. They do this. That's why I said Jessica Tarla from Fox, she might well go over here and join the view because she act just like him. She used their talking points. She might well just be on the show with them. But we definitely finna check this one out coming from Doug. He said that Joy Behar just goes insane. She getting mad uh, over the, the presidency. He said that uh, you know it's bad when even The View tries to save Biden from debating Donald Trump in public. So now they don't even want Joe Biden to debate Donald Trump. Because Joe Biden can't debate Donald Trump. He can't. The man can't even finish a sentence. He, can't, he don't know where he's at when he's on the stage. He's always falling. You think this man finna de debate Donald Trump? He can't debate him. But we definitely check this out. Make sure y'all hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Shout out to everybody showing so much support. Everybody been leaving positive comments in the comment section. Also want to thank everybody who clicked on the video for the very first time. I appreciate all of you. And I want everybody to please hit that like button because I want to see... A lot more people see that Joy Behar and whooping them, they just always make a fool of themselves. Talking about one man, and that's Donald Trump. So make sure y'all hit that like button for me. Without further ado, let's go ahead and dive straight into it. And let's hear them cry about Donald Trump like they always do. Let's go. Well, The View argues over if Biden or Trump are going to have a debate. And Joy Behar, her fangs come out. That really her is bangs. her fangs. I did not Photoshop those teeth on there. Welcome to Doug in Exile. I'm Doug Tenaple. This is where the happy patriots are. Today is President's Day, okay? It's President's Day. And as election 2424 24 gets closer, it's not 2024, is yes, it? Yes, it is. Yes, yeah, 2024. <laughs> I feel bad sometimes when I say these dates because I think, where did this come from? I know. Yes. How did it go fast? I miss like 19, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. <laughs> you know? We have to start the whole show with Whoopi Goldberg realizing it's tw the year is 2024. This could be the first time in more than 50 <coughs> years that we will not see a presidential debate. And here's what the president and the Republican frontrunner have to say about it. Take a look. I don't think he's yeah. going to run. But I'd like to yeah. go for immediately debates. I'd like to debate him now because we should debate. We should debate for the good of the country. Donald Trump is ready to debate you right now. Do you accept? If I him, I'd want him to debate me too. You got nothing else to do. <laughs> and it's that video footage of Biden, which is why the Democrats do not want Biden to debate. They would never agree to have him debate anyone on a stage mm. between now and the election. Hillary should have said to him, get away from me, you orange menace. Yeah. <laughs> you know, she should have said that. I always want to comment on the writing at The View. Here Remember, they have the highest paid writers, union writers in Hollywood. Mm, they do. And the best thing they could come up with is for comedy is get away from me, you orange menace. I believe he said, shut up, man. I'll just keep yeah. quiet, man. And now she's admiring Biden for saying, shut up, man, or keep quiet, man. Is that the peak of our debate now? Crazy. Of all the comedy writing we could come up with, she's smiling and remembering how great it was that Biden said, shut up, man. I can't think of a more basic caveman stupid thing to say that requires no writing at all is shut up, man. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, there is that. But, you know, the truth of the matter is the research shows that presidential debates have minimal, if any, influence on election outcomes. Yes. People don't remember it. These two, this is like a replay a play of 2020. We've seen the movie. Joy says that the debates have no effect on the election. This 
would have an effect if people saw by right. on camera and saw the way he acted. There's no way that wouldn't people would realize they cannot vote for him. He's incapable of being president. It's time a debate really worked was back in the, the Ice Age when Nixon debated JFK. JFK. Yeah. She forgot Ronald Reagan telling uh, Walter Mondale or Jimmy Carter he would not allow their youth and an experience to be held against them when they were trying to set him up for being too old. I don't think I need to see someone who has been twice impeached and is a disgrace and a one-term president with 91 counts facing him. I think oh, it legitimizes him. I don't need to That's be true. gaslit by Trump. We all know who he is. We all know what he stands for. We also know that Biden debated him twice and just like sort of mopped the floor with him. All people who support Biden oh, should be terrified God. to have him debate Trump. She's also saying that Biden mopped the floor with him. She gonna say but. See, here's the thing right here. How can Sonny Holston sit here and talk about Donald Trump when she just found out that her, that her own parents were slaveholders? How can she sit here and talk? Oh, uh, he's a felony. He got 91 this. He did this. Joe Biden mopped the flow. Joe Biden ain't mopped the flow with nothing. See, that's that right there is what I be talking about. They would not tell the truth. All they do is sit on their show and lie. That's all they do. Just sit there and lie. Yeah, her, uh, she up there trying to, she was up there laughing and smiling when she did the interview time. Her parents were slaveholders, but now she's trying to sit here and talk about Donald Trump. How can you talk about somebody? I mean, it just don't even make sense. Listen to this crap this woman just said. When the last time Joe, Joe Biden ain't never mopped his flow at his house. How is he going to mop the flow with Donald Trump? Joe Biden don't even mop at home. Look at, listen to this crap. This is just blankly just dumb. Someone who has been twice impeached and is a disgrace and a one-term president with 91 counts facing him. I think it legitimizes him. I don't need to That's be true. gaslit by Trump. We all know who he is. We all know what he stands for. We also know that Biden debated him twice and just like sort of mopped the floor with him. All people who support Biden should be terrified to have him debate Trump. She's also saying that Biden mopped the floor with him. Remember when Biden lied saying that the 51 FBI agents supported the idea that Hunter Biden's laptop was Russian disinformation. That is, as long as you can gaslight and lie, mm -hmm. a Democrat will win a debate. But not if you ever had to go toe to toe on the facts saying they will not let even these two old men, these two extreme personalities, they will not let them debate. And it's not Trump's side that does not want the debate. It's Biden's side. You will not see mm -hmm. him debate. If you look at any of the studies, yeah. every Ameri most Americans that watched it thought that Biden won, not only on policy, but on demeanor, especially. Does this person have the temperament to be the president? We know who Donald Trump is. I don't think you give him that type of platform. But I really also, if, if Biden flubs... Yeah. They'll go, be all over him. They're afraid. They're covering. They're trying to cover for Biden, not agreeing to a debate. And this is every Democrat that wants to vote for Biden agrees he should not debate. And that tells you everything you need to know, which is that if you ever may, had an informed choice to actually see that man in a debate, you would not vote for him. That's what they're all saying. That's what they're agreeing to. Those people that are never Trumpers, those people that really want to put uh, country before party. Those people that want to save this democracy, all you need to do is vote but, for Joe but Biden. But we want to it's hear from that him on policy. Smiling. Yeah, you, you, <laughs> hold, hold on now. You say if you want to save democracy, vote for Joe Biden. Man, I'm telling you, they they talking points just piss you off, bro. Because they just be sitting here lying. What? This man can't even finish a sentence. Look what he did. Like they, see, the thing is, they, they hate Donald Trump so much that they won't even call out Joe Biden flaws. They won't even talk about how bad of the country this is. They won't talk about all the illegal immigrants that came across the border that Biden doesn't allow. They don't talk about that. They try to ignore that. Let that would have been Donald Trump in Joe Biden's spot right now. And Donald Trump was allowing all them illegal immigrants. The wars happened. Inflation was high. Just, just imagine what they'll be saying about Donald Trump right now. But since there's somebody that they like, they just... Act like it never happened. That, like, it, this is some, like, dumb talking points, man. This is crazy. 
That's what they're all saying. That's what they're agreeing to. Those people that are never Trumpers, those people that really want to put uh, country before party, those people that want to save this democracy, all you need to do is vote but, for Joe but Biden. But we want to hear from that him on policy. Smiling, saying it, oh my just God. vote for Biden. Turn your head off if you're for democracy. Yeah, it doesn't work that way, Sonny. They tried it last time, and now people are seeing what you people put in the office. I don't think it's a question of whether Biden's going to show up. Biden has always showed up. Mm -hmm. It's crazy who has never showed up. And he's up. a trickster. This time, you can keep doing that gaslighting, girls. It is going to be Biden. I, I would put money on it. Will not debate Trump. What do you guys think? Does Biden ever agree to debate Trump? I'm he ain't going to do it. Shout out to Doug. Another great video. Like I said, I will leave the original video in the description. Make sure y'all go show Doug some love. But we all know, man, Joe Biden cannot debate Donald Trump. He, he can't, and they know it. I mean, they just sit there on that show and just lie. That's all they do. Especially Sonny Joe, like all of them. That's all they do is just sit there and come up with lies to say about Donald Trump. And it's just crazy. But like I said, y'all let me know what y'all think about this. Of course, y'all already know me. I do not like the view at all. I love talking crap about them just because, uh, like I said, how they treat Donald Trump, they treat him like that for no reason. And it's all because of hate. They don't really have a, a real reason to hate Donald Trump. You know what I'm saying? They don't have a real reason. They just hating on him. And it's just crazy. But like I said, thank you all for watching. Leave your comments in the uh, comment below. And I'll catch y'all in the next one.